This is AJ here with another fun video bringing you guys one of your favorites, Teramasu cups. Same thing as Teramasu, just in a cup. So in my last video, I told you guys about um, the Seviati cookies, you know, all the hassle that it took me to go find one at the store and I ended up having to make it myself. Well, this is why I had to make the lady fingers. Why? Because of the Teramasu cups. So now you can use your lady fingers that you've made with this recipe. So of course it was made specifically for a date night with my wife and you can enjoy it for a date night for yourself as well. get started, just separate your egg yolk from the whites and on a bain-marie, whisk your sugar and the egg yolk on medium-low heat until the sugar is fully melted. Now make sure not to cook the eggs at any given time in this process. We are not trying to cook it, we are simply melting the sugar so it can fully embed it with the yolk. So now, ladies and gentlemen, this is where you can truly impress your significant other by doing restaurant quality dessert at home. Trust me, they will appreciate it. Once the sugar has melted, remove the yolk from the heat. And now, go ahead and add your mascarpone cheese. You can use an electric mixer for that, but it is truly not necessary. Um, we are using one simply because I want it really smooth, creamy uh, for picture purposes, but not necessary. Mascarpone is not as firm as cream cheese, so it's a lot easier to manage, especially when you're trying to um, implement it into a recipe or something. So it's easily adaptable. It's very silky, velvety, it's rich and flavorful. Now once you've completed this step, go ahead and add your evergreen. Now don't forget folks, the full recipe is on our site at savorythoughts.com. You will find step-by-step -step guide as well as the exact measurement for each ingredient. Now once you've completed this step, go ahead and place the batter in the refrigerator while you work on the next process. And also, this can be completed in advance a day or two if you need to as long as it remains refrigerated. This step here is fairly quick and simple. Start by boiling your water and sugar together. Once the sugar has been completely dissolved, turn off the heat and then add in your espresso, the amaretto and coffee liquors. Now, you can use a really, really strong coffee or you can add espresso. Either way, you can easily make it at home. You don't have to go buy anything special for this. Just make sure it is your favorite or your significant other's favorite coffee. Now, since both amaretto and coffee liquors do have alcohol, you can actually make this without either one of them and still maintain that wonderful flavor. Simply get the amaretto flavoring and the coffee flavoring. And since it already has an espresso or coffee in it, you can actually omit the coffee liquor as a whole, but you can just get the amaretto flavoring. You will end up with the same great taste. Now here comes the easiest part, assembling all that goodness together. So go ahead and get your egg mixture from the refrigerator. Add the egg mixture into your cup. Go ahead and dunk your lady fingers or saviardi cookies that you've prepared initially and then just layer it up with uh, another bit of the egg mixture and with another bit of the saviardi cookies and don't forget don't be afraid to dunk those cookies remember your childhood and dunking cookies and milk same process just make sure you don't leave it in there for too long and finish it up with the egg mixture on top and sprinkle that with the dark semi-sweet cocoa powder and Hershey's special dark cocoa powder is highly recommended as it is goodness. 
So yes, you guys know that I love to eat. And of course, food makes you happy. It makes me happy. Even if you're having a bad day. And what can be better than sprinkled semi-sweet dark chocolate on top of licorice coffee flavored dessert? And look at that. I made her happy. A beautiful date night with our wonderful tiramisu cups. And now it's your turn. If you like this video, please don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Leave us a comment. Let us know how you enjoyed it. Thank you.